Okay, okay, so for this video, I want to talk about this particular issue where we say it happened where where for inside marriage, but with the hardly the year of family because marriage in a place where we say whatsoever way the apple for inside there, you are supposed to carry clothes to cover them. You know, go fit talk out, you know, go fit show them out. Thousands, thousands, or millions. Of married women, they go through sexual starvation. Yes, their pecus is hungry and they are not well satisfied. Lots, lots, and lots of married women they go through this problem, and they know if you talk and come out, they know if you show them to the world. Why did they try to cover this whole thing up? This sweet woman that you used to know, this lovely woman that you used to know, this caring woman that you used to know, you don't turn to tiger. Angry soul, wicked mind, a nag, a problematic wife. All this, like because there is a part of her we know they eat way. There is a part of her where hungry they beat. And they talk and say, knocking na mental food, love making, it's a mental food. And you need to feed that part of your life. Yesterday, when I did do my live show, a woman was talking about herself. He said, waiting she go feed do to her husband will be two minutes man. We no care. There are some two minutes men. There are some men we no say. They know they try for bed. And they are trying to work on it. But we also get some that are very, very much intentional about what they are doing sexually to their wives. They know they have a problem. They don't care. They go tell their wife, manage me like that. There is no way where woman go fit to manage you in that aspect. It is not a dead end problem. There is a solution to it. In fact, many solutions they to them. But some of these men, because this two minutes problem, it's not a problem to them. I don't explain, give my people say. A two minutes man, eh? you see that two minutes where it's a knock, it does satisfy because their satisfaction at that minute will be say they release their bowl of water, they are satisfied, the enjoyment where they want gets, they don't get out, they relief where they want gets, they don't achieve them. It is not left for the wife, the woman, they leave them hanging, self centered men. And they will not be telling their wife, according to this woman that was on my on my live show, he said the husband said she should manage him just the way he is. Like now, there are things you can do if you can't see, say you be my way, be say not if they feel satisfy your woman. You can go and do some medical checks. If at the end of the day medical checks come through, say nothing you can do, say that so now as you did, now so you want day. My brother, there are things whether they call sex toys. Go and get a plastic bowler for your woman, or go and get a vibrator for your woman. Now wickedness, it becomes wickedness if you know you have this problem and you constantly restrict your wife from finding a way to ease herself. Like this woman that was with me on my live show. I said, why don't you go and get some sex toy? He said the husband forbid her not to do that. That then I went, now, now that wizard, witchcraft comes in for this type of man. You cannot satisfy your woman. And you forbid her from getting things that will help her. And then I come to talk, say, 
this is now what intentional the man is very much intentional with what he is doing to this woman if you are a two minutes man get some sex toys before you do make sure that you use that sex toy to satisfy your woman so that when you go in for your two minutes ride two minutes enjoyments it will be that you have satisfied your woman and you also you satisfied yourself you are a you are a very very irresponsible man if at the end of the day you knock your woman you bust your bowl of water and you left your woman hanging it is very very irresponsible of you Lots of women are going through this problem. You think they are married. You think they are having fun. You think they are sexually satisfied. Or is a lie. Women where go come come at. Married women where they stay with Bola for under the same roof. Go come come at. The first thing they see in a man's body. The first place they look at in a man's body. Na Ibosa's area. Those women that are so sex starved to the extent if katu that they wash katu katu uh, uh, they kiss they are make us not wet. Imagine a married woman sleeping and wake up in the in the morning. A, a clitoris does stand. She don't come without a man touching her. That's called messed up. Yes. When you starve your woman to that extent, even if you say you they put bola for there every now and then, every now and then, but when you fail to satisfy her, you are satisfied because you not to the extent your water come at, even if it's one second, your water come at. What happens to our own water? So if you think that you are going in there every day, every day, but you have failed to satisfy her, you have failed to make her reach orgasm, you are still starving her. And she's going to have monies where, where a, a clitoris is going to stand and before you know she's going to come, she's going to reach orgasm on her own. That is the body sending a message. And a lot of married women, they experience this thing when I talk so. To wake up early in the morning, your wakeus, your antenna does stand. If they do you like this, if they do you like this, instead of your husband to come put bola inside, make you enjoy the process of that thing coming out. Now so you wake up in the morning, the thing will hold you, it go hold you, it go hold you. You go, the thing will by itself poor come out. The body is hungry. A sexual part is hungry. So, man, it is bad. It's okay if you are you, you are a two minutes man and you want to be okay with it. It's okay. But when your wife wants to find a miss, at least she not talk say or she not carry make us go give another man make another man come knock him for her. If she choose to get something like sex toys, please let her be. You are even supposed to join her in that. Nothing sweet pass say now your man now he hold the plastic bola now he hold the vibrator till they give you better satisfaction. Wait, bola no fit do. I see lots of women coming to my show to complain about this. Please, ma. My husband is a two minutes man. I don't know what to do. What can I do? And other set of people, now all those men that are far away in abroad. Hmm? When I go marry with my kid for Nigeria, and when I go, they give her things not to do. You are far away, and your your wife cannot get a plastic bowler. They make all of them, they give you a picky way, not be on her own. These are things we will be we both are saying, say, these are, women are dying, women are dying. They produce plastic bola. The tradition in you will not tell you, say, my tradition forbids me and my wife to, you are not okay with the man. You are not. 
if your tradition is teaching you how to sexually starve your wife,